Hi, everybody. Good morning. For those of you on the East Coast, good afternoon. It's noon there, but it's only 9 a.m. here. So this is my first Rise and Shine at 9. I'm going to do this every morning, Monday through Friday. I'm really excited about it, um, being able to connect with everybody on a daily basis. So um, hopefully a few of you get on the live video. If not, they can always watch this um, as a recording. Anyway, so the first thing that I want to talk about this morning are the amazing incentives that I'm offering all of you um, in campaigns 24 through 26. So I posted photos of the two items. But first of all, um, these are for leadership. If you get five qualified new recruits in campaigns 24 through 26, I am going to let you go shopping on my e-store and spend $50 and it will ship directly to you. Basically, what you're going to do is um, text or email me a list of those five qualified new recruits, which are new recruits who place a first or second order of $150 or more before shipping and taxes. So once I get that information um, and verify that you did have the five qualified new recruits, you're going to send me your shopping list um, up to $50, and I will go ahead and place that order on my e-store and have it shipped directly to you. So good luck um, earning that incentive. And then a second incentive that I'm doing is that if you advance in title for the first time to Bronze Ambassador or above, you're going to earn the jewelry armoire that I posted a photo of. It's really nice. It's black leather with the tan um, felt lining and everything. So um, all you have to do is advance in title for the first time to Bronze Ambassador or above and maintain it for two more campaigns. So that's a t for the next two campaigns. So that's a total of three campaigns. And as long as you accomplish that, I'm going to go ahead and have one of those shipped directly to your house. And then the next incentive is that if you, hi, Caitlin, she's always here. I can always count on Caitlin. So the next one is that if you advance two titles during campaigns 20 through, 24 through 26, you're not only going to earn the jewelry armoire, but you're also going to earn the rolling makeup card. It's pink. It's amazing. Um, so again, you have to advance in title twice during the um, incentive period, and then you have to maintain that second title for two, two more campaigns, and then I'll have both of those items shipped to you. So then, um, so we got those going on, and then also during camp, um, from Thanksgiving Day through Christmas Day, I'm going to do a drawing every day on my live video. And you don't have to be on the live video to win. You just have to be a member of um, the Facebook group for Team Shine. So every day I'm going to do a drawing. I've got some, um, some of the new makeup mirrors. I've got some of the pewter Christmas ornaments, um, just all kinds of neat stuff that I'm going to be giving away. So I'm going to do a giveaway every morning. Um, so that's exciting. Okay, so now that we've covered all of those, I want to talk about what am I doing today to grow my business? I'm doing a lot. Um, first of all, I do work. Monday through Friday from 8 to 5. I'm able to pop on here because most of the time I do work from home. So I'm able to pop on here and do the short little um, morning videos. And then this evening I'll continue doing my working my Avon business. But the first thing that I'm going to be doing is for all of my pending representatives that haven't placed orders yet, I am mailing them the Fiesta Flyer and the Build the Love Earn an iPad flyer. So I'm taking both of these um, along with one of my business cards. 
and putting them in an envelope and mailing them to all of those pending. So other than the flyers and the business card, it's going to cost me 50 cents for each one of these. I'm sending out 80 of them, so that's $40 that I'm investing in my business. Um, I'm also, I ordered from Town and Country these 10% off stickers. And so I, I already have sent out my campaign 24 brochures. I have a Mexican restaurant that I have brochures on. Um, when you go into the lobby, there's a bookcase there. And so I have two stacks of my brochures that are there at all times. And what I did originally, I used to go up there every day to restock them. And it was just too time consuming. Um, and sometimes I'm not here. So what I did is I offered the host, his name is Ivan, I offered him um, $50 worth of product, Avon product every month. Um, and what I do is I take in my brochures at the beginning of the campaign and he keeps it stocked for me so I don't have to keep going up there. Um, but anyway, so I've already dropped off the campaign 24. So the campaign 25 brochures that I have, I'm going to put one of these they're really bright, um, real catchy. So I'm gonna put one of these stickers on all of the Campaign 25 brochures. I think I ordered 300 of them maybe. So I should be able to go through Campaign um, 25 and 26 as well and get these. I've already got my brochures labeled, but I'm going to add these to the front of the brochure to um, try to get people to order online so that I'm not having to go out and deliver orders. Um, I do an order every, every Friday. I submit an order. So I do two orders per campaign. And so every Saturday I'm doing deliveries. Um, and it's actually been a lot better doing it that way. I used to do one order per campaign and then that Saturday that I was doing deliveries, I mean, I was just running around like crazy trying to deliver, you know, 20, 25 orders. And um, now that I'm doing it every Saturday, it's not as stressful. I'm usually, I start at 10 in the morning doing my deliveries and I'm usually done at 10, um, noon or one o'clock. So it's actually made it a little bit easier. I have the rest of that Saturday to get some work done. And I like to take Sundays off. Sundays are my day, my day to get caught up around the house or relax, spend time with my husband, whatever the case might be. Um, this Sunday, this coming Sunday, um, our 16th wedding anniversary, not wedding anniversary, we're, we're actually not married, but our 16th anniversary together um, was October 20th and we both forgot and we realized it a couple days later. So we, um, I bought tickets with my um, earnings from Avon to go to the NHRA. Good morning, Sarah. I love Sarah. She's my friend. Um, anyways, so we're going to the NHRA winter finals in Pomona on Sunday and we're really excited about that. We haven't been to the drag races together. Um, I haven't been since I was a kid, so that's really exciting. Okay, so I'm going to be sending those out today. I'm also putting these labels on my brochures. And I also, I bought um, from Town & Country the fundraising kits. Thank you, Caitlin. Yes, 16 years. Wow. Um, but I bought... The fundraising kits. I bought um, two of them. They come 10 in a pack. So I bought two. So I have 20 of these fundraising kits. So I have to work on putting my cover letter together and deciding exactly who I'm going to send these to. There, I'm going to send um, probably half of them to churches and half of them to, um, to the local schools in my area. So I'm really excited about this. I'm hoping to get some fundraisers. But these packets are really nice for, for the 10, that it's a pack of 10 and it's $24, if I remember correctly. So um, yeah, I could have printed them myself, but these just look so professional. Um, so I'm really excited about this. They have 
the bookmarks. They have these um, cards that you can put in there. Do good, feel good. Um, some flyers. And then they have all of the different flyers for fundraising. I'm going to tell you the main reason I wanted to buy these. Did I just drop something? Oh, it's just a business card. The main reason I wanted to get these was for the envelope that they that you send them in. Oops. <laughs> Do good, feel good. I love these envelopes. They're so nice. Um, and honestly, that's the main reason I bought them. But look how professional um, these look versus me doing them myself. So I've got 20 of those to go out. Um, I, I doubt I'll get any, any fundraisers immediately. If I do, that's great before um, campaign 26 is over with. But otherwise, you know, we have all of next year. you got to prepare ahead of time. So I got that going on. And then um, what else am I doing today? I have some prizes, drawings that I still haven't mailed out. Um, the hats and the, the books, those are going out today. Um, oh, I'm also going to um, do a video later on for the campaign 23 drawing for the sales and everything. Um, now that campaign 23 has closed. So um, I also, here's a thought. For um, campaign 24, I sent um, a text message to all of my customers, letting them know if they spend $50 or more in campaign 24, they're going to get 20% off, but they have to spend $50 or more. Thank you, Sarah. I'm stunning. Huh. Um, so, so those are some of the things that I'll be doing today to grow my business, to grow my team. You have to do something every day. Like I said, I work a full-time job, um, Monday through Friday from eight to five, but I do take the time to work my business every single day, every weekend. What did I do over the weekend? Um, I use Buffer to schedule all my posts for my team group and also for my um, Avon Facebook page. So every other Saturday, I go in there and I schedule all of my posts for the next two weeks. So I did that this weekend. I had order deliveries on Saturday. Um, I did all the printing for all the stuff that is going out to my pending representatives. Oh, I'm trying to think what else I did. I don't even remember. I just, you know, I want to grow my business. That's the bottom line. I want to grow my business. Um, at the beginning of 2020, I want to retire and I want to move to Texas where my daughter and my granddaughters live. And so in order for that to happen, I have to double where I'm at right now. And the only way I'm going to do, be able to do that is to grow, grow, grow. And the only way I'm going to be able to grow is to work hard and work smart and invest in my business. Um, for instance, if y'all aren't buying um, extra brochures during the holidays, you're not going to, you're not going to grow your sales. Um, this is the best time of year to, to gain customers. And so you need to be ordering extra brochures. I challenge all of you to find a business wherever it is that you live, go out there, do the research, talk to the business owners, find a business that you can leave brochures at and keep those brochures stocked up and you're going to get new customers. The Mexican restaurant that I leave my brochures at every campaign, I'm gaining at least one customer new customer from leaving my brochures there. Another thing that you can do is I use campaign mailer. That's another thing I did this weekend. I put in my campaign mailer order. And what they do is for a specific price per brochure, they will mail them. You go in and you put all your um, customer information in there. Oh, thank you, Sarah. You inspire me too, girlfriend. You're such a, a kind soul. And, um, 
And I love that about you. And it makes me want to be a, a better person. So good for you. I love you. Um, but anyway, so campaign mailer, you go in there, you put all your customers information in there and every campaign, um, about two weeks before a specific campaign, you go in there and you check which ones you want to send the brochure to and you pay for it. Um, for instance, I think it's a dollar nine or a dollar 19 per brochure, but it includes the cost of the brochure and the mailing. It's way cheaper than doing it yourself. It's way cheaper and less time consuming than me driving around trying to deliver those brochures to all my customers. When you've got 100 customers locally, um, by the time you deliver 100 brochures to all those people, add up your cost, add up your time, why wouldn't you use Campaign Mailer? Um, that's what I do. And so every campaign I use it, it's great for those that are out of state that you can't hand deliver the brochures to. Again, it's cheaper to use Campaign Mailer. Their web address is campaign-mailer.com. I love them. Absolutely love them. And they give you different options. You can add flyers, your own personal flyers. Of course, it costs more. You can include the outlet with the brochure. Again, it costs more. But um, check them out, Campaign Mailer. Check out Town & Country. I understand Emily was telling me that Town & Country now has um, Christmas cards or something to that effect that you can actually order. Um, so I'm going to check that out today because um, I made the decision that I'm really going to send out um, a large group of Christmas cards this year. <laughs> it just gets so expensive by the time you buy the card and the 50 cent postage. But you know what? People appreciate that, and so that's something that I have to do. I'm also looking into using, um, I apologize for my work phone ringing in the background, but um, I'm looking into the um, send out cards. Um, I have several friends that use send out cards, and um, so I'm gonna look into that and see if it's worth my, my money and investment to use send out cards where you just do it all online um, I love being able to do stuff online and not having to hand write everything out. So I'm going to look into that. So that's called send out cards. If anybody decides that, um, that they want to try send out cards, they have one of the levels that you can sign up with is actually free. And I do have a friend that, um, who's an Avon representative, JP, that I'm actually going to use his reference code when I sign up if I do. So I can always share that with anybody else that's interested. So um, these are some of the things that I am doing. Can, you know, for Sarah and Caitlin, you guys are on the call. What are you guys doing today to grow your business? Anything that you guys want to share? I'll give you a few minutes. Take a sip of my coffee. Ah. I have to, while, while you guys are thinking of something to share, yeah, our office phone rings off the hook. Oh my, I just, um, I was going to just share something with you guys and I completely already forgot what it was. Um, just like that, I forgot. Um, hmm. Oh my gosh. I have no idea what I was going to say. Oh, well, my brain just went. <sighs> so what do you, what are you guys doing to grow your business today? Come on, share, share, share. I like it when people share. Sarah, what are you doing to grow your business today? <sighs> I wish I could remember what I was going to share with you guys. That's so frustrating. I'm thinking. Think, think, think. <laughs> I, I, I was saying that I was thinking, and my husband, he's in the other room, he says, I smell smoke. <laughs> I must be thinking too hard. My, my head's smoking. That's so funny. All right, well, I am going to cut this off. I was going to try and keep these um, um, rise and shine at nine. Oh, I remember what I wanted to tell you. So I think it was, I don't, I think it was at our leadership kickoff last year in San Diego. 
we had a guest speaker and I couldn't tell you what her name is, um, was off the top of my head, but it was like she was speaking to me. <laughs> she told me, she said, well, she told the audience, um, she was talking about um, direct selling um, business owners, how, you know, we, most of us work from home. And she said, she was saying, you have to wake up, get up, get dressed, put your makeup on and get out. She said that, you know, you can't sit around, wake up when you want, sit around in your pajamas um, and expect to, to accomplish anything. She said that you have to look your best at all times because you never know who you're going to run into. Say you want to pop on and do a live video and you're still in your pajamas and your hair is like, ah, um, <laughs> You know, how, how are you going to accomplish these things? And so she said, every morning you've got to get up, wake up, get up, make up, and get dressed, you know? And so uh, me and Emily, my upline, looked at each other, and we just started busting up laughing because Emily was always telling me that. And, you know, it's like, are you a CEO? Are you the CEO of your company? If you are, you have got to get up and get dressed and put your makeup on and act like a CEO. So that's my parting words from today. So everybody have a great day. Grow your customer base. Recruit, recruit, recruit. Grow your team. And I promise you, you're going to be successful um, with your Avon business. So bye, everybody. Have a wonderful day.